welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Shirley also known as Backtalk and I do anything Disney and that behind me is Marceline if you're new to this channel she shows up a lot if you're coming back you already know that noise is Marceline that's her scratcher post um I just sat down to film this and that's when she decided to wake up hmm all right what I have for you today is a really quick haul from Target um they had this designer collaboration come out yesterday and so I went in and got a bunch of dresses too many dresses because they all look so floral and beautiful and I felt like they all could be for Disney bounding so I just bought a bunch a bunch of dresses and I can't keep all of them there's no way <laughs> and so what I decided to do is just do a quick haul and fit on for you guys so you guys could help me out because like I said I can't keep them all um yeah I don't know, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and get started. I did shift my like videos a little bit and bump this one up because this one you only have 30 days to return if it's like a designer, which is nice because before when they had the designer collaborations, we only had 14 days to return, like back when they had the Hunter and stuff. Um, so it's nice that they're giving me a whole month, but I don't wanna keep them for a whole month. <laughs> they're just really expensive. <laughs> and so I just wanna make my choices now all right so let me start with the first one and like i said i did try them on and i'll show the video here but um so here is the first one and most of them are by love shack fancy that is like one of the collaborations they did and so this one is like a purple and i thought it would be perfect if i was doing like tangled uh disney bound it's not long at all it's actually really short i didn't check if it had pockets when i was trying it on but i don't think it does no it doesn't most of the dresses did have pockets, so it's unfortunate this one didn't. Um, oh wait, no. <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, it's really, really cute. It's really roughly. I can already imagine it. It's super easy to like Disney bound it. I can put some gold accents for her hair. Um, I can maybe use a couple uh, green ones for Pascal. I don't know. I really like this one. I think this guy's a keeper. He's just a little short. <laughs> I felt like it was really short. And I don't think it's that short, but because the the it's like a bell curve on the bottom, it just feels short on me. Or maybe I just haven't worn dresses since I'm at home all the time. But um, let me know, is it just me or does this dress look short on me? I really like it though, so I think I'll still keep it. I'll just have to put shorts on if you guys agree that it's too, I don't know. All right, the next one that I tried on, and they all got jumbled up here, is this guy. No. Give me a sec. Ah, oh, there it is. It's this guy. Which I felt like it was kind of like a moo. -moo. <laughs> I don't know if that's a real thing. From I just think of moo-moos from 51st Dates when Rob Schneider was wearing a moo-moo and he mentioned it and I, that's when I think, oh, that's a moo-moo. But I don't know if that's actually a moo. Anyway, it doesn't matter. But it's like four patterns like four different flower patterns although this one uh goes again there's really no figure to it it's just like a really really long gown um and this one i was thinking sleeping beauty <laughs> because it looks like a sleep gown to me um like i said it has no shape so when i tried it on i just felt like i was just like inside a pillowcase which is nice, right? Like it's not too tight, but it also was a lot of fabric. So for like Disney World, it'd be maybe too much. Disneyland, it might be just fine. But like, it might be a little too long to like get in the rides. Like, can you imagine getting into Matterhorn with something this long? I don't know. This guy is definitely like a, I'm not sure. We'll have to see what you guys think. So this was the second one. All right, the third one that I tried on, I think is this one. Yes. Um. This is really loose, very simple dress. Again, it has multiple patterns, but the last one and the first one uh, will go again. And then same thing with this one. Again, this one would just be pretty much any Disney princess that I can like tie it into. It does have more uh, pinkish colors, but it has this pretty yellow in the middle. So I could try to swing it as Belle a little bit, but it's just, it was really, really freeing. It also feels really, really short on me. I don't know, you guys will have to tell me if it's really, really short. And these guys came off while I was filming. So I don't know that I would wanna be in the park and one of these falls off, <laughs> but I might have to like safety pin them or something. Like I said, it's really, really freeing. It was really, really nice. I don't remember if it had pockets or not. It doesn't seem like it does um, from here, but yeah i think this might be a keeper but it's it's gonna be harder for me to tie it with a disney bound or justify it 
All right, the next one that I tried on, well, I guess I'm just gonna have to go out of order because I do not remember. I think it's this yellow one. <laughs> All right, this yellow one was cute. I really like this yellow one. Obviously, this is Belle, and this one did have pockets right there. And I, again, I like the Belle-ness of it, but I didn't know what to do with this. Anybody know what I'm supposed to do with this? Like, do I tie it in a bow? Do I let it hang? What? What? What's the point of these? I don't know. I wish they would have done that. I wish it would have just been a collared or something. Is it just me? I also bought another shirt from their last collection that had these strings, and I haven't worn it because I don't know what to do with the strings. Help me out. I really like this dress, but if I can't figure out what to do with these, I think he might get returned. I'm sorry. But yeah, she's really beautiful. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know what to do about this one. All right. The next one I tried on, I'm pretty sure is this. This feels like a costume. I'm not going to lie. When I put it on, it feels like I am wearing a full on costume. And obviously I'm thinking of Aurora on this one, uh, just because it's like the pink. I think this dress would be beautiful for Disney Paris. Uh, and then like taking pictures by the castle. It has these huge, look at these bell sleeves is that what they're called that's what i'm gonna call them huge so huge like on most days this would annoy me <laughs> because i don't know it would just be everything but it would be so cute for pictures and like i said if i was going to like a character meet or a dining meet or disney paris this would be so cute it's not my favorite fabric it's like a silky fabric i know what's wrong with me you can kind of see it there um i just don't like this fabric but I like the fit of the dress. I did get it in two sizes just because you can't try it on in stores yet because of COVID. Um, so I get it in a six and an eight. All of these are mediums, by the way. I don't know if I said that already. I don't think I did. They're all mediums. And then some of them that have a zipper, they came in sizes of two, four, six, eight, so on. So this is a six. I bought the eight as well. I don't know where I'm at <laughs> because I've been at home wearing t-shirts. So no idea what my size is right now. So a six fit, pretty good. So yeah just giving you that for like reference in case you wanted to go and buy these dresses yeah i don't know what to do with this dress um compared to the other ones it's on the cheaper side and i say that with like ugh, because they're not cheap at all at least for target they're not cheap i don't know about you but i'm used to buying like 12 dollar dresses this is 45 and i don't know if i'll get my wear out of it it's definitely cute and i think it'll even be cute for like a spring wedding or something I don't know, let me know because I'm really conflicted about this one. The next one I tried on is another one that is fitted. So I had to, uh, again, I bought two sizes. The six ended up working really nicely. The only problem with this dress, now this dress is so magical, so pretty. You can already imagine pictures with it. It's so wedding, like spring wedding again, if you were going to go. The only problem, it is so sheer. It is beyond sheer. You'll see in like my try on, I didn't even turn around for you guys because it was sheer <laughs> and I'm not about to get there. So <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, is there a trick for it? Like it does have a uh, under thingy, under thingy, that's so bad. It does have one of these, but it's just that sheer and this is sheer. So you can just see everything. And I don't know, again, it's really cute. It fits really well. I'm not used to this style of dress at all. If you look at my closet, I have a lot of just like skater type dresses. So I don't know, I'm just so conflicted. The next one I have, it's a return. Unless you guys are really convincing, but <laughs> I feel like I already made up my mind. It's this white dress. I really had high hopes for the white dress. Um, I think white dresses are really cute and this pattern, this lacy pattern is really nice during the spring. The only problem is that the dress itself is very boxy on me on the top. I wish the top was a little more fitted. Um, and then obviously the dress is supposed to be like boxy, but it's just too boxy. It made me think of like if I were to go golfing or <laughs> play tennis, um, although I would never wear this to play tennis because it would get dirty. But you know what I mean? I just thought more of a sporty vibe than something like that. I really thought this would be really cute for a Minnie Mouse Disney bound with the new Kate Spade purse that my parents-in-law got for me and like little red shoes. And it just sounded really cute, but then once I tried it on, I don't know, it just wasn't for me. Uh, so that'll probably be a return. And this guy was 45 as well. And then the last one that I tried on for you is this pink 
like bruised dress. This one could have worked for Coco if I was Disney bounding as like Mama Imelda or someone. It's a little more floral than theirs. Not floral, sorry. Uh, pastel than theirs. But it's just, I don't know. There was something missing when I tried it on. And it's also very sheer on the back. So I also did not turn around for you for this one because you could see everything on this one. Um, I like the sleeves. Like if this was a top, I would so love it. This would be a really cute top all the way here, obviously. <laughs> or like two-piece. Like if this was a two-piece, that would be amazing. But it's not. So I don't know. I'm not too convinced about that one either. But yeah, <laughs> that's a lot of dresses. And all of these dresses, if you're curious about price, were in the range of 40 to 60. So it, I could just range there. Like I said, I bought them with the intentions of knowing I was going to return most of them. Uh, <laughs> yeah but it, it did feel weird spending that amount of money especially since i haven't like left the house at all so far please 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 help me out with this let me know which ones you like which ones you didn't which ones do you want me to return my money asap hopefully the collection is still out there hopefully this video is out soon or uh fast enough that you can still go to the store and get them i didn't notice there wasn't that many people in line for the collection compared to the last collection where it was like Aisha Mizrahi and Hunter and things like that. So I think this this collection had less. Um, there was like five designers. Most, well, no. All everything that I showed you was either Lisa Marie Fernandez's collection or the pretty, is this Swiss Marina? Or, or the lovely Shaq Fancy. So it was either this collection or that collection that I bought, but there was two others at the store that I went to. But yeah, please help me out. Let me know which ones you like. I do think some of these are really cute for like easy Disney bounce. It just takes a cute lounge fly backpack and like makeup or style of hair to really make it into a Disney bound. But yeah, I really hope you like this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And please help me out. Leave a comment telling me which ones I need to return ASAP before the 30 days. <laughs> Until next time, adios.